how to buy and send the AI to MetaMask. Hello guys, welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how we can import and buy the DAI uh, crypto using MetaMask. So there are two ways that we can do this. And the first way is that, as you can see, I have my MetaMask in here and I'm using the Ethereum mainnet, as you can see in my networks. And now what I want to do is to click in here where it says buy. So this one is going to redirect me into the Transact uh, application so I can buy uh different tokens so i can go into continue to transact and now what's going to happen is going to pop up a new window so i can pay and buy crypto so i'm going to pay this is the amount that i'm going to pay and where it says you receive you want to click where it says ethereum network and you want to select the one that says dia so i'm going to select this one the next thing i want to do is to select where it says buy now so i have to be really sure that dai it's the same as my MetaMask uh, account. So this one ends with an E2. So I'm going to select my MetaMask. I'm going to see that this one ends with E2 also as well. Double E at the very beginning. So let's be sure of that. It's going to be sending us a verification code. So you, need to, you just need to put it in here. And then you have just to put your credit or debit card in order to make the transaction. And after you've done that, you want to go back into your MetaMask. And you should see your cryptos right in here now if you don't see the token that you just purchased you have to add it um manually so what we want to do is to go into coinmarketcap.com and we want to search right in in here dai so once we select the crypto do you want to copy and paste this contract or do you want to select this icon of metamask so it can be added automatically so this is the token would you like to import this token? I'm going to select add token. And now if I go back into my MetaMask, you're going to see that my DIA uh, has been successfully added. And you should see your cryptos and your money right in here. Now, just in case that you can't make the purchase inside MetaMask, the other thing that we can use is an exchange application. Now, as you can see, I have one called Binance because Binance is actually really cool for me. And what I do is to select this option right here where it says buy crypto after I created my free account and it says pay with I'm going to select the currency that I'm using in my bank. So in this case it's MXN. You can select USD or whatever you want to. And then after that, if you want to pay with a credit or debit card, you select this option. You select how much you want to spend and in here you might want to select the D uh, AI, but in this case, since I'm in Mexico City, I'm not able to make the purchase of uh, directly from that token. So what I do is to purchase Bitcoin or whatever other whatever other crypto you want to buy. And after you make the selection, you go into continue and you make the payment. And once you see here in your dashboard that your token has been added into your account, the last thing you want to do is to go and select the one that says trade. So as you can see, this is the option that we want to select says trade. And I'm going to look for the BNV and the AI. So what I want to do in here is to select the maximum amount of the token that I just purchased. And I want to trade this for the right one, which is right in here. And lastly, guys, if you want to receive the token, you just need to copy the address that it's right in here. So in this case, if I am on Binance, I can go and select withdraw. And after that, it's going to be uh, having us a question of what coin you want to be sending. So I'm going to select the one that says DAI and it's going to be asking us for a address. So I paste the address right in here and select the network so I can make the transaction. Now, as you can see, the network says that the B, uh, BMV smart chain is the most cheapest one because this one is like really, really cheap. So you just select the amount that you want to send and go ahead into Wetro. And this is the way that we can send and receive the token DIA. Just remember to have exactly the same network right here in your MetaMask and on your exchange or the other wallet that you're going to be sending your tokens, guys. So let me know if you have any questions. Thank you for watching the video. And don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about the MetaMask application. I'll see you guys on the next one.